and together with the Pasquamana ORDs and special guests this evening to call the 2014 Red Event Pamana Awardees. Starting with the most fascinating person of the year, let's welcome May Falsis. May, please come and join us. May Falsis was born and raised in Philippines and immigrated to the United States in 1985 and currently resides in sunny Orange County with her husband of 28 years. Along with her favorite pet, Bailey. Ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome and give a round of applause, most fascinating person of the year, May Falsis. All right, the next awardee is also a most fascinating person of the year. Let's welcome Audrey Nazareno de Leon. Audrey Nazareno de Leon is an advocate and a consultant. Married to Tony De Leon of Wienhawa, Hawaii. Audrey Nazarene De Leon was sponsored by Searchlight Promotions. Congratulations to their lovely daughter, says Audrey. Love that Joe Bob. Rosie Nazareno. Once again, put our hands together for Audrey Nazareno de Leon. Our next awardee is actually a dynamic duo from Texas. Together, they make the most fascinating couple of the year. He's a board of director and member of, and a state pressure for the Philippine American Chamber of Commerce of Texas. No wonder he looked familiar to me. I saw him two weeks ago. And she is a board member of the Philippine American Chamber of Commerce of Texas, president of the National Multi-Ethnic Families Association. Let's give a big round of applause to the most fascinating couple of the year, Mr. Richard McDonald and Mrs. Nana McDonald. Here we are. Richard and Nana are leaders of the Filipino of the Philippine American Chamber of Commerce in Texas and therefore are great advocates of economic development. So once again let's give this most fascinating couple of the year a big round of applause. Richard and Nana McDonald. I understand one of our awardees is here. Once again, let me reintroduce to you one of our most fascinating persons of the year, a banker. Let's welcome May Thousis. There she is. She was born and raised in the Philippines and immigrated to the United States in 1985. She's a passionate Zumba diva where she converts her free time with great friends advocating good and healthy lifestyle. Most fascinating person of the year, May Faustis. Let's give her a big round of applause. Our next awardee is a businesswoman, entrepreneur, and the title here says she's America's Mrs. Philippines. Let's welcome Rose Pascal. An entrepreneur in the real estate and financial services industry for over 20 years. She does not look like she's been in business for 20 years. She looks so young, doesn't she? Let's give, once again, Rose Pascal a big round of applause. America's Disability. Our next awardee is one of our most Fascinating person of the year and a great supporter of the Losazo uh, conglomerate. He's a philosopher, psychologist, TV talk show host, international investor, advisor. Let's welcome Dr. Cyrus Tangarlo. Dr. Cyrus Tangarlo. 